look at the blend. Ah! One swipe. This all. Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. So today we're going to be trying out some Makeup by Mario makeup. I received his collection and I'm literally so excited to try this. It's been on my desk for a while now. Oh, guys, the colours in here. The colours. Look at that. The problem that I have here is that I don't know what look to do now. I just don't know what look to do. There's just so many colour choices. There's this thing called this Master Crystal Reflector, which I'm dying to try out. It's like this pale white sparkle. And you can literally put this on on any eyeshadow and it just like jazzes it up. I used to use something like this from Bobbi Brown when I used to work on counter. And yeah, it was something that you can just like wash over a lid and it would just make it look so effortless and like sparkly. This during Christmas, I'm just saying. Today's post notification shout out is going to go to Vishnu V Krishnan. So thank you so much for subscribing. I really appreciate it. And if you guys want to get a post notification shout out, all you have to do is subscribe, press the bell button, and then let me know in the comments below when you've done so. Can we just take a moment to appreciate these beautiful mats? I don't even know what one to start with, but let's prep the eye. I got a new shade in a Tarte Shape Tape. I got medium tan sand. I'm just gonna blend that out. There's so many beautiful colors in here. I don't know, like guys, I don't even know which one to start with. I think I'm gonna go in with this first. I'm gonna go in with this brown first. I'm just gonna blend this out to create like a really like blown out outer corner. That shade is beautiful like for every day on its own. Can I just say that like blended so nicely. Don't worry about this bit because we can always like clean it afterwards. I'm gonna take some of this dark brown here, kind of like buff this into my lash line and the outer corner. I wanna create this like effortless smoky something i don't know <laughs> look at the blend look at the blend this is what i was going for i just wanted this like effortless kind of smoky eye look then we're going to take the first brush and just really buff those edges out this is the master metallics i'm really drawn to this color look how that swatched Ah. Ah. <gasps> one swipe god i have no words guys that is beautiful i don't know what color to go for do you know what i'm gonna go with that blue i'm gonna go with that teal i am with these kind of shadows, I do like to use my finger. It's the quality of that pigment for me. And this is using it dry. Imagine like wetting it. There's a By Mario mixing liquid. And I think you can mix this with like the eyeshadows to get more like intensity. So I'm gonna put some in this palette here because you've got tray space. And I'm just gonna put a little bit. So I'm using some of that mixing liquid with this shade right here. And I'm just gonna pop that on the inner corner. That's definitely added a pop. To be honest, I cannot fault the shadows. I cannot fault them, they're beautiful. You can use this for any occasion. You've got so much choices. Like these are definitely worth your coin. You can get good use out of them. The only thing I would say is that like, if you do want a bit of everything, you have to get the different palettes. Like you either have all the metallics in one or the, all the mattes in one. Like you don't have a mix in just one palette. There is a By Mario pen eyeliner. This is called the liquid liner in super black. Now I'm really growing on pen liners. I always said I don't like them, but there's some bomb pen liners coming out lately. Another one that I really, really love, I actually did a video on it, is the new Huda Beauty uh, Life Liner. Yeah, Life Liner, quick and easy. This is bomb and it's really black and it does not budge. So let's see if this is really good. Mm. 
it is pouring out there but yeah beautiful liner that applied so nicely the problem with eyeliners before like i just felt like they would just drag my skin like the pen liners okay there's also a by mario brightening pencil in light so i'm just gonna put that here in the waterline I haven't done this in so long where I put a lighter colour in my waterline. There's also Master Pigment Pro Pencil. This is in super black and it comes with like a little brush. This will be great for a smoky eye liner. I feel like I need to do another look with these. Let me know in the comments below, but I'm just going to put this under here. Can't even see my waterline. I'm just going to take my makeup wipe and clean these edges. I'm just using Tweezerman's Eyelash Curler. And then I'm gonna put some of my Huda Beauty Legit Lashes. It's one of my favorite mascaras at the moment. I'm not gonna put too much, I'm just gonna put, I'm gonna pop some lashes on. I'm gonna take some of the Master Crystal uh, Reflector. You can't really see it. It's just this like sparkly shadow. Yeah. I'm being like not too neat with it. I love it. I love it. <sighs> I feel like I should be going to a ball right now with this eyeshadow. These are the lashes that I'm going to be using today. I'm going to use some of my NYX primer. Today I'm going to be using my Huda Beauty Faux Fills Luminous Matte Foundation in the shade Dulce de Leche. I'm going to blend that all over. I have a few scarring here and there so I definitely need a bit of coverage. And I'm a bit more tan so Dulce de Leche is like matching me perfectly. It was already like such a good match but like right now it's like my skin. Just putting a little bit more on my cheeks. Then I'm going to use my new Tarte Shape Tape. It just blends so nicely like into this really like highlight shade without being ashy. Oh my god, I've missed doing these kind of videos. I need to do a cut crease, I need to do a halo eye. Maybe I should do a step-by-step -step easy halo eye tutorial. I'm going to use some of my Laura Mercier powder in my sponge and just really like press that in there. I'm gonna leave that in for a bit. I'm gonna go back in with my mattes and just blend a few of the browns. So I'm first gonna start with the first shade I use and then concentrate the darker like really close to the lash line. And I'm gonna take a really tiny brush with that dark brown. Just concentrate that right under my lash line. And then going back with that first brush and we're just going to blend those two slightly together. And I'm going to put some of that light eyeliner back in there. I'm going to brush all of this powder off. I'm going to use my Beauty Bay bronzer in the shade Caramel. Something I learned from Tammy is like when Tammy, uh, makeup by Tammy, uh, she's so good at makeup, guys. She like taps in her bronzer and her blushes. I never done it with my bronzer. I'm always like this, but this just makes it diffuse so much nicer. I'm gonna go in with this Treat Me Sweet Powder Blush by Miss Lynn. It's like a peach. Then we have this highlighter. It's like a cream highlight basically so i'm going to use that on my skin you guys know i love these kind of highlights where it just like melts into the skin it's a bit sticky than what i'm usually used to but it gives a nice glow it's very it's ever so subtle then i'm just going to set everything with my mac fix plus vitamin c spray i'm going to take this shade from the metallics palette I'm going to use this by Terry Unforget 
Unforgettable Lip Definer. This is in the shade New Naked. I never used to do this when I used to apply my lip liner, but I discovered this hack on TikTok and I filmed it and I tried it and it's just so good because it really gets like the perfect lip shape. So I just really like stretch the outer corner of my lips. I'm gonna use this ballet gloss. This is by Beauty Bay. I put my hair in braids overnight. I think it was for two days actually. And it looks a little bit cray cray. But it's all... All right guys, this is the final look. I really hope you guys enjoyed this kind of testing out video. Um, I had so much fun and I'm so so impressed by the quality of this makeup I mean I had no doubts because you know it's the master himself I love it I love my eye makeup today the only thing I will say I'm not too impressed with is the mixing liquid I'm not really into that to be honest and also the what was it the highlight not too fussed about it but the rest is like bomb I'm definitely gonna be using it let me know if you want to see another look I'll probably create a more looks on my Instagram Here's like a close up of the eyes. Let me know what you think in the comments below and yeah, I will see you in my next video.